Hi, my name is Steven and this is the Royal Singer T2 by SBC Royal First in Italy. I'll be walking you through today uh, regarding the features, options, what I like about this machine and I'll give you a brief demo of how this machine actually looks like. Two panels, this is a double group, so it's a mirror image of left and right. In the center, you have a LCD display. The LCD display sh will show you your short time. When you make a shot, it will tell you what is your shot duration. For example, when you press, say this, you notice that the shot time runs. This will tell you that roughly whether your shot is done properly, your shot is under-extracted or over-extracted. This is quite important. Yes. This is a high-group machine. It comes with a tray that you can use for your normal size cups or you can use a tall takeaway cup as well. There's two froth wands, one on the left, one on the right. The froth wand comes with a joystick frother. It makes it easier for you to froth your milk. So the frother goes down, goes up, uh, it locks it in place. It also comes with a non-locking frother where it doesn't lock it in place. The power button is here. There's four knobs. Um, one, zero, two, three. Zero means the machine is off. One means that you are turning on the machine without the heating element. Number two means you are turning on a single heating element, which is half the machine. Number three, you turn on two heating elements for your machine. If your cafe is having a low traffic, you can save your electricity cost by turning on just a single heating element rather than both. In the event that if you have higher traffic, you can turn on both your heating element. This machine takes roughly 10 to 15 minutes to heat up the water. How do you know whether the boiler is done boiling the water? From this button here. This green icon or button, the light will turn off if the water inside the boiler is sufficiently heated up. If it's not sufficiently heated up, the light will turn on to tell you that it is trying to boil the water. You have the Espresso Italiano logo here to show you that the quality has been certified by the National Institute of Espresso in Italy. You have a water dispenser here. This water dispenser pulls water from the boiler itself, bypasses the group head. Okay, I'll be showing you how to do um, coffee for double shot 8 ounce cup. It looks like this, as well as how to auto froth. Now, the first step is you need to have ground coffee in your porta filter as such. Make sure you tamp it properly, place inside the group head, place two cups. Okay, next up you need to press the double shot button which is on the left bar. Next up, um, blow once. Place your pitcher of milk inside. When you're ready, turn it on. Once the sound goes deep, turn it off and this is how you froth your milk. Remember to always wipe your wand, place back the wand and blow once and you have a very nice smooth creamy like texture of milk. Goodbye and please subscribe. Goodbye and please subscribe. Bye bye. Bye bye.